Okay. This is Christopher Morris McGilvray reading for the role of Martin in the movie The Preacher Man. What, what? Doing a little shopping, are you, Fred? Heard about the break in over at your church the other day? I heard they did a lot of damage. Fred stops, glares at him with contempt. Come on, Dad, just get in the car. It's just a minor setback. Doesn't change anything. In fact, incidents like this only unify us on this matter. And what matter is that? You know good and well what it, I'm talking about. We're not going to be forced to sell out. You're only prolonging the inevitable. Mr. Gannon, he's a businessman. Guys like that, they always get what they're after. Not in this instance. He won't. And not you or any other half-wit he's looking for him are going to change that. Half-wit? There's no need for name calling. Is it Fred? Fred starts towards Billy, but Martin purposely trips him. Fred hits the pavement hard and drops all his supplies, cringes in pain. Whoops! You have to be more careful, Fred. Sarah rushes to Fred's aid. Daddy, are you okay? I'm fine. You asshole! What? He tripped. Billy... Billy throws a punch, but Dan blocks it and then slams Billy's head against the van, knocking him unconscious. Fred is wowed. He glances at Sarah with awe. Dan moves near Martin, who appears intimidated, but whips out a blade. Try that with me. You try that with me and you see what happens. Okay. Dan quickly smacks Martin across his face. Like that? Martin angrily lashes at Dan with a knife, but Dan catches his wrist and twists it back to bring Martin to his knees in pain, dropping the knife. Now apologize to the Trumbles. You go to hell! Wrong answer. Dan twists Martin's wrist to cause more pain. Ah! Ah! All right, all right! Okay, I'm sorry, all right? Dan releases Martin. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you think you are, but you just made a big mistake, pal. Dan grabs Martin, lifts him up, yanks him close. I'm the king of mistakes. Dan then delivers a powerful headbutt and slings Martin to the ground. You broke my nose! 